I could do, because you couldn't you couldn't even see the lasers. My body parts are nowhere to be found, so I might as well come over here. I also like how that attack only affects me. All the other enemies are standing on the ground. Oh, not affected. Bryce, look over there. I'm holding. Oh my god. Oh, I was pressing it the whole time. Bryce. Only two guys left, and I can't regenerate. Thank you. What the fuck happened there? Right, be careful. Press jump, nothing happened. What the fuck? So there's another another form because uh, I chopped up both arms. What do I do now? It's still not over. The boss fight continues. Well, again, this is nonsense. They don't even give you enough time to get there. Fucking asshole, finally. Son of a bitch, what a dickhead. Oh. Ouch. All that for nothing. Keep chanting the spell! Okay. I guess I got him. Oh. <laughs> this is how it went down. What the hell? He stole his eye. Ah. After what he just did to you, you don't stand a chance. Right. Don't worry. He's all mine. Take this. Leave it to me. This feels like the end for me. Don't you? We uh. he killed Papa Smurf. <laughs> Superman. Keep running. 
I'll be right behind. You fool! Rice! Rice! Oh, won't let you get away that easily. I'm taking you with me to hell. Rice! Oh well, good. Good, no sequel. Get rid of him. <laughs> The end. Good. They all died. Good. <laughs> Black hole, son. Why don't you come and erase this shitty game? <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, it's her first concert, huh? Here she is, Jailbait McGee, an exclusive close-up that sends you to jail for pedophilia. <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, yes. Wow, this song blows. Well, I can see the game developers have no idea about the music industry. They think this would be a pop song. Wow, and that's the ending. That's the fucking ending after all that. Bryce really does die. <laughs> okay. Alright, well, I will mute this because it fucking sucks, and, uh, <clears throat> I am going to review this game, but I have to play some, there is a multiplayer mode that I have to try, so I cannot, I have to, I have to withhold any reviewing of this game until I try out the multiplayer modes, which I'm not going to do immediately, but, um, all I can say is this, okay plot, you know, the characters were alright. And the idea of the regeneration and never being able to die is interesting. And they completely botched it. Yeah. With horrendous repetitive gameplay, horrible controls, completely just, just horrible gunplay. Let's see. Uh, combat that pretty much just, uh, it just concerns swatting left and right with your thumb to kill things with your blade. It was horrible. It was fucking horrible. Some of the puzzles not of not being explained properly, not giving you the, the the tutorial tips that you need when you actually need to use them, and expecting you to remember them 45 minutes to an hour later. Uh, let's see. The best thing about the game were some of the boss fights, except for that last one, of course. That last boss fight against Astaroth was fucking stupid bullshit, tedious, stupid nonsense. But uh, this game could have been a lot better if the gameplay was better, and they completely botched the gameplay. Graphics were good. Frame rate was also ass. Frame rate was bad in a lot of places. And when you have a game that's action-packed like this, and you need to be, be able to do quick reactions and stuff, low frame rate just is inexcusable, especially in 2012. This should not be an issue. Also, a whole upgrade system that's completely worthless. Once you get your first set of upgrades, you're never going to be able to swap out to anything better because... You don't have enough upgrade points to do it. It makes no sense. So the whole game you're collecting experience points that you're never going to use. Wow. Fucking stupid. Are they still playing this shitty song? Oh, fuck me. <clears throat> well, like I said, here's now here's a completely different contrast. Last last year they had Shadows of the Damned which a lot of people have compared this game to and said, oh, they're new IPs, they were like a horror-style story with a lot of comedy mixed in. But Shadows of the Damned had really spot-on gameplay. The gameplay, a lot of the time, yeah, there were a couple problems, but it was really solid. And uh, it was fun, and the puzzles were ingenious, and the boss fights were all fun. 
you're never really just like standing around scratching your head saying, gee, what the fuck am I supposed to be doing right now? In this game, that's pretty much commonplace. You don't know a lot of times what you're supposed to be doing. Like in that final boss fight, like in a couple of the stages, you just don't know, or certain puzzles. It hasn't been explained properly what you're supposed to be doing yet. And so you will fumble around endlessly until you finally fucking figure out what it is you're supposed to be doing. It's a shame because you can tell the design team, like the, the design of the characters, the full motion video cutscenes, the story, the design of the game is really good. It was just the gameplay and execution that were horrible. So you have one half of the development team did a really good job and the other half completely fucking botched the title. Very, 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 very disappointing to see that, to have potential that's squandered like that. But, um... Oh, yeah, let's now watch this uh, underage girl do some dancing on the stage to a horrible fucking song that they apparently thought was good. And, uh... And then uh, that's it. And like I said, I, if you if you do want to see if there are any redeeming qualities to the game, I will be attempting some of the multiplayer so that we do see if it is good or not. And then I will review the game after I have played all those modes. So, all right. And now a cut off for new album to play us out. It's Nikki Sterling or whatever the fuck her name was. Not Nikki Sterling. Nikki White. Mickey. I don't even remember what her last name was. Nikki Silvers. Nikki. I have no fucking clue. Here. Oh, wait a minute. They're playing Megadeth. Alright, that's okay. We'll lower it a little bit. And what a waste that Megadeth gets licensed to do the music for this fucking game. Of all the games they could have done it for, they do it with a game that was horrible. <laughs> I feel so bad for them. Oh, they even wrote again to the song, Never Dead. Huh. Never Dead. We wrote this song and it's a shame Cause no one's gonna buy this shitty fucking game <laughs> Oh fuck us, fuck us in the ass, yeah Uh. You know, the other thing, the game really pussied out on blood. You notice that uh, all the blood on Bryce is, is, isn't red at all. All his blood is fucking white. I get the feeling originally it was all red, and then they, they pussied out and said, Oh, we had to make it white, it's too gory. Fucking pussies. Oh, Rebellion. What game will you fuck up next, Rebellion? <laughs> See, there you go. Art director. This guy did a really good job. The art director did an amazing job. The sound producer did a pretty good job. And then they fucking handed it to a game development studio that sucks balls. <laughs> what a shame. What a fucking shame. Never dead. <laughs> oh, look, a secret ending. Like, we didn't know that was going to be at the end of the credits. Oh, 
Oh, it's just blood, that's right. Nice. Oh, guess what? Sweet cheeks. I guess you're pretty lonely without me, huh? What's up? It's hell over here. My kind of place. He calls her from hell. <laughs> what a cute ending. He calls her from hell. Oh, new abilities unlocked. What the fuck? What new abilities? Ah. Oh. So you get 40, 40 achievement points for beating it on easy and 45 for beating it on normal. What the hell achievements were unlocked at this point? A bunch of that are stupid. The game's over, dumbasses. Cowardly words. No good for education. What the fuck does that mean? Ugh. Desperate. Losing limbs makes the attacks more powerful. Oh, now you get extra ability slots plus three. Guess what? The game's over, cocksuckers. No one wants to fucking play this again. Nobody! Rude words. Do not use in front of kids. Bow gun collected. They even give you a new gun for beating the game. Alright, that's it. It ends. Alright, so that's it for Never Dead's campaign. What a letdown. Uh, but I'm uh, still, uh, still going to try out the multiplayer and we'll see how it is.